Hi artists, it's Allie from the Tacoma Art Museum and today for our TAM at home we're going to explore some works of art that you can find in and out of the museum. We're going to focus on the element of art texture and uh, some of the different mediums that artists use in the art that they create. The first work of art that I'd like to share is entitled Tear This Wall Down by Marie Watt. Take a few moments to quietly look at this work of art. Start from top to bottom, work your way down. What sorts of textures might you feel if you could touch the art? And what materials do you think the artist used to make this work of art? And then in contrast, by the same artist, Marie Watt, Let's look at a work you can actually see that is outside the museum, entitled Blanket Stories. Given our COVID days, we can't go in to the museum currently, but this is a work of art that you can see from the outside. How might this work feel different from the previous one? If you were to touch this work of art, do you think it would be rough or smooth? hard or soft? And what if I told you that originally this work of art was made out of the same material as the previous one that we looked at? Now let's make some art of our own practicing the element of art texture. Let's use the basic shape of an apple to explore making a smooth apple with watercolors, a hairy apple with crayon and marker, and a modern textured mixed media apple with cardboard and marker. Follow along as I create an example of each type of textured apple. Thanks so much for joining me today in our exploration of the element of art texture. I hope you can take some time to find the Blanket Story sculpture that's outside of our museum. Uh, please remember not to touch, but just imagine what kind of texture you might feel if you were to be able to feel that piece. And um, I hope you can continue to make some great art. Bye-bye!